another beautiful morning. So we'll go um, where we saw that harder beast the other morning about this time where he came out of the bush into the open. Uh -huh. We'll go in that direction, see if we can okay. see him. Yeah, be and, good. And if we can see some zebra or eland in that plain before they can see or hear us, maybe we can make a plan and get on them. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say we should probably go try to see if we can spot that big boy again. Yeah, yeah. Must be the stallion. He's kind of, you know, so he's looking after his harem. This blue wildebeest already moved in here with these other zebras, which is good. Those ones will come across. That's good. Let's go around this side. Give it one more try. Okay. One more try. They stopped again. Let's have a look at them and see if there's a nice big one. Another one walking in front. Looks like another stallion. Yeah, it's also a stallion. He's got a thicker neck. Yeah, yeah he's a big one also. He's one here. You can take him out if you want to. You can take him right there. like a good hit. Yeah. He's a fat one. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry about the casing unless you want to keep it. <laughs> I'll be the Here we go. I think. Just for in case. See. It looked like a very good hit. We'll just give him a little time before we go up there. Beautiful, beautiful Hartmann zebra. Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> and a very, very good shot. Look at all the blood. Yeah. You see what I mean? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, it's got a nice... Right here. Yes, perfect. Yeah, it doesn't have that many fight marks and bite marks. It's going to be a beautiful rug. Yeah. Well, we came out this morning and, and we spotted this herd of Hartman zebra and uh, it was quite challenging. They kept eluding us on our stock and uh, we finally drove around and spotted them again and got out and in total we probably walked a couple of miles after it and uh, finally had some good cover. Um, we had to get kind of go around a few wildebeest and springbuck and, and a couple other species to get to it, but uh, we were able to make a good stock. Rickus was able to get, get me on it within about 200 yards, and, uh, and I made a good shot on it. Had a real nice male Hartman here that make a nice rug. <laughs> Looking forward to it. So the Hartman zebra 
um, has this clump of fat, little dewlap, which mm. the Birchels doesn't have. The Birchels tend to have a shadow stripe in the white, like a darker brown stripe, where these ones don't really have that. Um, and these ones have a complete white belly, mm. whereas the Birchels, the stripes go all the way around. And um, there's also a different in the ears, are shaped differently. This one's got this very distinct little round mm. tops on the ears. <laughs> and uh, they tend to grow just slightly heavier than mm. the Birchels also.